All right, if you're traveling abroad or at least hoping to travel, you need a passport. And if you don't have one, getting one is proving to be a lengthy process. The U.S. Secretary of State reporting an unprecedented demand for passports. But as our Candace Charles reports, don't cancel your travel plans just yet. It's tiring. Nevadans are experiencing a world of woes as they attempt to travel, but they're not alone. We've had an unprecedented demand for renewed travel. In 2022, the State Department issued a record 22 million passports. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken said in the House Appropriations Subcommittee hearing that we're on track to break that record. As the federal government quickly tries to fill positions, it cut during the pandemic. With COVID, the bottom basically dropped out. Uh, on the system. The State Department continues to rebuild as it fields half a million applications a week. I'm not sure how much busier we can get. Uh, we're getting about 40 to 50 phone calls a, a, a day. Darren Neeson is the manager at the Winmo Library, which started doing passports in 2017. Winmo does about 80 a month. Appointments always fill up, but never this quickly. <laughs> They're gone in like three minutes. He suggests be patient, um, explore many options. There's probably about 20 places in the county you can get an appointment. A lot of them are booked, but uh, do some legwork. Keep checking websites. People do cancel appointments. For these Nevadans, all bets are on and the payoff is big. If uh, I get the passport, then I'm going to be happy. <laughs> you got to go on a cruise. So remember, expedited processing times is seven to nine weeks. Routine is 10 to 13 weeks. So get those appointments in early and as soon as possible. We'll have more details on our website, anewsnow.com. For now, from the Wilma Library, I'm Candace Charles, Eight News Now. Passport renewals can be done, <clears throat> excuse me, online. You send in the application, a DS-82 with your picture and your expired passport.